I always knew I was destined for something else. I welded because it paid the bills. And I welded because I was good at it. But I always knew in my heart there was something else. And this is for you that's watching right now. I always felt in my heart there was something else for me. And every day just didn't feel quite right. And you overcome that every day. You, you lace your boots up. You get back to work. You do whatever. But you can feel it in your head and in your heart. And if you can guff up enough, you can pull enough sand, enough salt out of your boots. When I walked away from that, it was the hardest thing I've ever done in my life because that was a guaranteed paycheck. It was a damn good paycheck. And right. it was something that I was proud of. And my family was proud of. And when I jumped off that cliff, and it literally was jumping off a cliff into entrepreneurship and my own ship, and being responsible for myself and giving away that, that safety net of, of a paycheck, which was going back to that episode with us and set the artist free and stuff like that. When I did that jump, it was the best decision of my entire life because days later, days later, when I signed my first contract with barbecue, when I first did my catering gigs, when I first did whatever, I looked back on that and every day that I laced my boots up was like doing a jail sentence. So for years, and I mean 20 years, 30 years, I was every day showing up to someone else's company and I literally felt like I was doing a jail sentence. And it didn't even register to me until the day I was set free. And like the tears to my eyes right now it was the biggest aha moment in my life. And even if I go broke doing this now, I'll go broke a free man. It's insane to me. Like I, I can't even put it into words, but to make my own future now, it's yeah, it, it takes my breath away.